The battle on Ukraine's eastern front is reaching a pivotal point in the war with Russia. Experts say Robotino in the south and Kupiansk in Donetsk remain focal points of dueling offensives. Ukraine's troops are coming under constant drone fire, but the mission remains to cleave out a land bridge between Russia and Crimea and cut off Moscow's forces in the occupied areas to the south. The Russian command realizes the dangers of a breakthrough. Large reserves of the Russian armed forces have begun to arrive in the Robotina area. But neither army can function without ammunition, and Russian Defense Minister Sergei Shoigu has told workers at a military plant in the Tula region to set up non-stop, round-the-clock production. Shoigu has also recently traveled to North Korea to try to convince Pyongyang to sell artillery ammunition to Russia. Uh, any arms deal between the DPRK and Russia would directly violate a number of UN Security Council resolutions. We're continuing to monitor this situation closely, and we urge the DPRK to cease its arms negotiations with Russia and abide by the public commitments that Pyongyang has made to not provide or sell arms to Russia. Meanwhile, Russian officials vowed that Tuesday night's drone attack on Peskov airport would not go unpunished.